New at five, a convicted, cold, calculated killer who made a special needs man dig his own grave could be out of prison very soon. The victim's family now begging Governor Newsom to keep him behind bars. Our Medeiros Bab joins us here live in studio. Medeiros, the family running out of time. Yes, Alex, John, the governor only has until mid December to deny parole to 57 year old David Wiedert. Wiedert killed 20 year old Mike Morganti back in November of 1980. His family still haunted by his cruel death. You know, why did you, why did you hit him with the baseball bat 64 times? Why was his skull kicked in? Why did you stab him in the stomach with the shovel when he reached? Hand out and grabbed your leg. I mean, it is, it's, it's awful. And you, and you picture your brother getting the crap beat out of him and never fighting back. While most people celebrate the holidays, Vicki Van Dyne begins to cry as she thinks about the death of her brother 39 years ago. According to the Fresno County District Attorney's Office, back then 18 year old David Weidert kidnapped 20 year old Mike Morganti. Wiedert then drove Morganti to the foothills of Clovis, beat him, tried to strangle him before making him dig his own grave. He buried this boy alive. His hand came out of the grave. He came out of the dirt and he continued, to, they continued to cover him. There was dirt in his lungs. Weidert was sentenced to life in prison without the possibility of parole, but due to California law, his sentence is now reviewed every 18 months because of his young age at the time of the crime. Now, only Governor Gavin Newsom can make him stay behind bars. Morganti's family and Fresno County District Attorney Lisa Smith camp begging people to write letters to the governor, fearing that if released, Weidert, the cold blooded killer, will strike again. I'm not worried about you and I. I'm worried about the vulnerable people out there like Mike. That's who Weidert preyed on. I reached out to the governor's office, who responded with a statement saying the governor does not discuss individual cases, but can assure that each review receives careful and individualized consideration. Reporting live in studio, Madeira Spab, KC24, local news that matters.